What's up guys? I'm Chris with DeVille Magic and today you're watching a magic review on Timeless Deluxe Classic by Liam Montier. Welcome to the channel and thanks for tuning in. If you're new here and you're watching from YouTube, please subscribe to the channel Hit the like button, ring that notification bell so you don't miss a review, and comment on the video with any questions you have or things that you'd like to see reviewed in the future. If you're watching from DeVilleMagic.net, then tune in every week for a new review. What is Timeless? This is a mentalism effect where you are able to uh, reveal the time that a spectator has randomly chosen by turning the the crown of the watch and the kicker ending is at the end the watch has no hands so you're able to demonstrate mentalism by reading the time that they thought of and revealing it while they hold it in their hands and when they open their hands it's all basically an illusion because there are no no hands on the watch I have no problem showing you the watch as you will see that if you watch the trailer, you're going to see, you know, everything that I'm showing you. Uh, but I'm not going to show you the gimmick. The packaging looks like this. It's uh, a box and inside is a foam insert that holds the watch nicely, protects the watch. The gimmick is also in here. Uh, you get a tutorial. It's a download. Uh, the tutorial is good. It's shot really well. Um, I think it's taught by Andy Gladwin of Vanishing Inc goes over everything, the handling, the routine, a few other ideas. Uh, so it's all really good. I forget how long the tutorial is, but it's it's everything you need to know to perform this with confidence. The quality is really good, but there are two versions of Timeless Deluxe. There is the Midnight Black, which is a leather wrist strap. And then the other version, I think, is called the Patriot version. Uh, the watch face looks the same. The workings are all the same. The only difference is the band. So you have like a fabric band that's red, white, and blue. It's a nice watch. It's simple looking. So there's not going to be confusion when the spectator has to read the watch. As long as they can read an analog watch, then you're good to go. Difficulty level on this, it's extremely easy. Once you understand the method, it's very easy to perform. There's really no slights or complicated handling. The spectator is going to get to hold it. It's pretty well self-working once you have set things up. The setup, I'll get to that since I just mentioned it, takes all but five seconds. And the method is brilliant. Like, I, I was not expecting the method to be what it was. And at first I was just like, really, that's it? But then I realized like, that's super smart. So uh, yeah, everything quality is really good and it's really easy to do. Angles on this, it can be performed surrounded. That's no problem. You're not gonna wanna show it like right up in their face. You have it face down, they turn the crown, they push in the pin, and then you want them to read the time. So if you are the person, I usually I'll hold it that close, right? And and once they say okay, they have memorized the time, then I place it in their hand. They cover it. Everything's really fair. Arts and crafts. It's ready to go out of the box. All you have to do is the really quick setup. And as far as reset goes, it's almost an instant reset. But you cannot do it. You can't reset it openly. You have to kind of go off and and do the reset but you know that's that's kind of the case with a lot of effects pocket space it takes no pocket space because you are most likely going to be wearing it if you're performing it can it be inspected yeah i mean they're holding it and then in the end you're completely clean so they can inspect it they can pull the crown out again they can look at it super close and they can handle it there's nothing to be given away or they're not going to find anything on it so yeah it can be completely inspected once the routine is finished who would use this and is it a worker so this is a mentalism piece but then there's also that kicker ending so it's not just mentalism this can be used by anybody who performs magic i think that anybody can perform this and you're going to enjoy doing it people are going to enjoy getting to experience it so 
anybody can can perform this now if you're table hopping you can't go table to table with this you can do it at a table that's no problem but then you're gonna have to go off to do the reset so it can still be a worker in that sense like if you do a couple tables and then you go to get a drink or go to the washroom you can reset it come back out and do some more tables but yeah you, you can't really do it from one table to the next uh close up or parlor this isn't very good for stage and even though your participant can confirm the time nobody's going to see it if they're too far away but overall i'd say this is a worker i haven't got to the price yet so what's the price and and is it worth your money okay it's 40 dollars. i would say that's worth your money it's a nice watch you have a real leather strap it's it's not going to let's say this it can't break unless you drop it and break the glass but there's no parts on it that will quit working on you or allow you to not perform this right so in that sense i'd say this is a great effect and it's worth your money it's well made i don't feel like 40 dollars is too much for this pros and cons positives and negatives uh, so the pros, very easy to do, quick reset, brilliant method, just the method alone, that was a pro for me. It was one of those things where you're like, aha, negatives, there are some mixed reviews on this. I've seen a lot of five-star reviews, but i also seen a few uh, one-star reviews, and I read into them, and I don't agree with them. I, I agree with certain aspects of it without giving anything away as far as the method goes. Like, you do have to prep this ahead of time. And there are some things that can ruin it ahead of time. So you have to be mindful of what you're doing before you present this. Now that will make sense if you purchase this and, and learn how it works and watch the tutorial. That's not a deal breaker for me. It's very easy to work around that so that it doesn't happen. It's never happened to me. I understand why, why some people looked at that part as a negative. I can understand that. Uh, the other one, though, that I don't agree with is that a number of people had said that this wouldn't fool a kid, that this can only be performed in dim light uh, from a distance, and with that, I, I disagree. Uh, it looks really good, I think, and uh, I've done this in well-lit areas, as bright as the room that I'm in right now. Actually, I put a, a filter on on these videos when I edit them so it looks darker than it is but I'm in a really bright room right now and I perform this in in settings just as bright if not brighter like uh, outside when the sun's shining and I've performed this like I, I mentioned earlier fairly close up if you are preparing this right I think it, it passes visual inspection no problem I've never been called out on it I've never had anybody say something doesn't seem right with it so uh, when it comes to those negative reviews that I read, in my personal experience, I have to disagree. I think this is great and it's worked for me every time and got great, great responses in both the mentalism aspect and the kicker ending. It's a shocker when they open their hands and see that the watch is blank. And that concludes my review for Timeless Classic. I will leave a link in the description below. I would recommend picking this up. I think it's a great product and I think you'll have a lot of fun with it. So thanks again for sticking around. Please subscribe to the channel, check out my other reviews, and we'll see you on the next video.